Hey guys, and welcome back to Some Assembly Required Factorio with Adrimba. Hey, how you doing, CJ? I am doing well. I'm just wiring up the, uh, the poles that haven't been wired yet. Right, and let's grab a blueprint of this station. Well, something tells me that I'm not going to have the stuff for this station. There we are. Whee! I love screwing around the trains. We actually have a very nice train system. I'm pretty yeah. happy with it. I agree. No, I'm not, I'm not unhappy with it at all. I think it's... Pretty good. Mostly because so, you, you, you did all the work of setting it up. It was great. Yeah. <laughs> there's a couple of little sections that I don't really like, but that's more to do with the, the fact that we're using, like, I don't know. Like, the, the, the fuel stations that should just be, keep it simple, stupid. And we, we tried to complicate it a bit much, like with the, the same station that takes on the copper, the coal and the oil. Like shit like that, we should have just made it just oil. But yeah, whatever. Yeah, Funny. yeah, that was that was a mistake. I think you're right. Oh fuck, a duck. You say that almost once a week. You know that, right? At least once a week. Almost once an episode for the. Oh, I say it constantly. <laughs> I was talking to someone um, the other night about this, and most of my catchphrases contain the word fuck. I think that says a lot about my personality. This is a big oil field. I'm using excessive amounts of pumps just to guarantee you that this thing all. Oh yeah, yeah totally. Like they're, they're so in, they're so cheap, right? Thirty kilowatts is like nothing, just to guarantee that fluid flows the way that I expect it to. Yeah. Yeah, there must be a train here, because the thing is emptying pretty damn quick. Right, now I need to go back to... I might as well just take us back to restock Farl. Oops. <laughs> so, one train... To go back with no path. Good job. <laughs> one train comes here and, like, depletes the thing. Depletes the whole field. Yep. And then the second train queues up behind it. And then as soon as the first train leaves, the second train comes in and stops for like three seconds and then it leaves. Yeah, so well, there's no, there's no point in it setting now. There's no point in it coming here because there was already a train here. Yeah, very true. Right, well, so have you added any more oil fields as well. Uh, I am just adding it right now, but I need to nip back and grab some more steel. Run it steel. And iron. And, well, everything, because I'm worthless. Uh, I should probably make that. This should probably be four. Oh, not 4,000, stage jump. Oh right, I have a personal RoboBort in this campaign, don't I? I keep forgetting that I do. Hey. Oh, 
Why? Why? Why have I got 250 steel plate on me? Excellent I should have 400. Question. Unless we just didn't have any more in the, the system. Entirely possible. Steel plate. Yeah, we don't. Wow. I just don't think we've got steel plate going into the system. Oh, really? That seems unusual. Yeah. Well, I mean, we didn't have green circuits going into the system until like four episodes ago, so... Not that unusual. <laughs> Alright, so how's oil looking? Are we actually getting enough stuff coming in now? Probably not. There we go. Oh well, it looks like all of the all of the stuff's going. We've got a little bit of crude oil sitting. One point three k crude oil sitting in the uh, the tanks. Okay, well that's pretty good. Yep, they're all decent ticking away right now. So decent start. Yep. Right, let's get going. Zoom zoom! I'll go plug in the uh, the next oil station and get everything sorted up. And then what do you want to try to accomplish? Like, are we just trying to launch rockets or what do you want to do? We've already basically done like pretty much everything there is to do in this game, right? Yep. Aside from make it bigger. But that was yeah. the goal originally, just to make it very make big. Make it bigger! So. Yeah. I don't know. We'll see. I don't. We'll see how fast we can launch the rockets. I don't know, man. I'm still liking the idea of launching like a single rocket for every episode. Okay. You know how like um, I forget the guy's name now. I always forget this guy's name, and I feel really bad. That guy on Twitch. Yeah, the Twitch guy. Let's try to do it for every follower. Yeah, I think I know who you're talking about. You mention him almost every week. Yeah. <laughs> I never remember the poor bloke's name! Stijo, asshole confirmed. If anyone doubted that before this, then there's something seriously wrong with you though, so. Okay, so now there's no shortage of plastic. At least for Ooh. the moment. Well, there still is a little bit of a shortage of oil, but we're doing okay on plastic at the moment. Seems like there may be a small copper shortage. Well, that's curious. Very curious. One of these things got turned around. Excuse what me? was that? What was that? <laughs> what was what was that just no now? Idea. I don't know. I don't know. Fine. Uh... Okay. I like how as soon as you play storage tanks, you start getting the noise of uh, of liquids. Yeah, even when they're completely empty. Yeah. Hmm. 
I need some big electrical poles, please. And we're out of plastic again. Woo! That's a good thing, right? No. No, CJ, we need more plastic. We need more more petroleum. Well, I'll go check on that one more time. Let's just go see. Is this a... Oh, yep. Completely out of oil. Woo! So we're good on oil except for when we run out of oil. <laughs> really? Yeah. No. No. <laughs> I would never have thought that, mate. Yeah. So just so you know, we need more oil. Yeah. I, I, it's it's probably becoming like cyclical, depending on when the trains arrive. Um, yeah. We just need to get more of those oil stations up. Our very need first rocket oil. is only at fifty three percent. Mostly because the uh, the machines making rocket control units have like last priority on advanced circuitry. So, we're still spending a lot of our oil on trying to make more more modules. At least we're not wasting it on robots anymore. Or science. Yeah. That is a lot of belt storage, isn't it? Do you want to move to a fully robotic base? Or do you want to keep using belts? I like belts. I do too. Bel belts are half the fun. I feel like if you're playing Factorio at home, then like do a fully robotic base once. But I don't know. It kind of loses its luster after the first time you do it. But oh yeah, that was fun. Well, it looks like a, an oil train must have shown up because we have plastic now. <laughs> Typical. At least some. It's not really enough to get all the way down to the end of the, these, these machines, but... There you go. I've already got efficiency modules in virtually every one. What do you know? We actually have a fair bit of oil in some of these tanks. You think we could go with some more, uh... Some more crude smelting? Um, possibly? Might be an idea. Uh oh, you broke the trains. They don't seem to be working. At all? Well, a train has been sitting around. Clearly, oh, yeah, that's something. Just, that's just my farrow. Oh. There should be, like, trains that you can ignore. Yeah. Do we have no stone brick anywhere? I, I, I feel don't like know. We, <laughs> mu we must have stone brick. Somewhere. Ta -da. There's a stone line going down the bus for crying out loud. There's got to be stone brick. Ah, here it is. There's absolute metric tons of this stuff. Oh, 
Right. Okay, sorted. Now all I need to do is head to the oil depot and wire everything up and we should be good. Like 7.2 thousand oil just sitting in the, the tanks up at up at eight now. That's quite a bit. Yep. That will... Yeah, it's a big field. That'll work nicely once it gets here. I might set it up to go to oil one, then oil four. And the setup, it just seems to make sense. Instead of going like oil one, turning around, going to two, then to three, and then back up to four. I'll just do what I do. <laughs> I'd like to be able to run fast on a train. That would be nice. That would take a lot. <laughs> Uh, I made a mistake. You're making a steak? No, I said I made a mistake. I want a steak. And it costs me. I hate when you're messing with pipes and you accidentally, like, contaminate a line. Oh, uh, yeah. You gotta strip the whole damn thing. Yeah, that's real annoying. Yeah, so people have been giving me some, like, great advice on different things that I can do with the, uh... That I could do done with this, uh, this stuff. Like, for the, the oil setup, but, like, most of it would require a complete and utter retooling. And, unfortunately, that would take me fucking forever, so... No dice. So you're saying you've decided against it? Yeah, I'm just gonna keep using what I'm using. I mean, what I'm using right now isn't broken, so... Okay, right, so that's that set up. So I should be outputting that to there. Oh, feck. Yeah. Shit. Oh, Steejo, how are you going to do this? I may need to go and change some numbers around. Oh, that's annoying. Alright, but that's going to have to do us for this episode, so... Are we good? Yeah, we're just completely out of crude oil again. That's no worries. Well, I'm currently sorting that. But uh, yes, as always, thanks a lot for watching. I've been Steve, you've been awesome. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. See you soon.